Hi folks, welcome back. Yes, it's time for another reaction from me. We are here to find out if today's track is indeed flutiful or not. My name is Claire. I'm a flute player from Holt in East Yorkshire. And just before we get to today's track, I would love to invite you to one of my Flutiful Time live streams. So if you are a big music lover, which I know you are because you're watching this, then I'd love it for you to come along uh, to my live stream and enjoy some live music played by yours truly, um, some friendly chat with my wonderful, wonderful community. And I also like to share lots of facts along the way as well. So if you're interested in joining me for the next one, then do check out all the details on my channel page. So today's track, we are going back to the wonderful world of Nightwish. And today's track is I Want My Tears Back. So some flutiful facts on this one for you folks. This is the fifth track from Nightwish. Wish's album Imaginarium, which is the band's seventh studio album. It was released in Finland on the 30th of November 2011 and was produced alongside the film of the same name, name sorry, which was directed by Stobe Hayu and described as an emotional fantasy adventure. Uh, it does indeed feature our friend and fellow Brit and Yorkshire dweller, uh, Troy Donaclay on the Ulian Pipes. Uh, and this is a live performance from Buenos Aires in 2019. Now, this was suggested by Hans Jonsson. Uh, thank you very much, Hans, uh, who also goes by Drums and Gadgets. And uh, Hans says, I would like your reaction on this great great song where Floor and Marco are singing and Troy playing the pipes. Uh, it goes into being quite a wild folk song, says Hans. Uh, Troy has some great flute and Ulian pipe parts. Oh, I'm very excited now. And I must say, it's great that finally there is somebody who reacts to Troy's excellent work. Keep them coming. Well, thank you so much for that, Hans. And uh, if you have a uh, suggestion for a track you'd like me to react to, do check out the pinned comment uh, below. Right. I'm really fine up for this one now let's uh, let's get going Yeah, you want to hear a song? It's coming.
know what to do. I know you can feel what's coming next. So get ready to dance, to jump, move around. So that that's definitely the first time I've watched something uh, to react to and not stopped it halfway through. And there were many, many reasons for that. And I think that'll be obvious uh, from what I'm about to say. So uh, I'm not going to say uh, anything else on that. But oh, wow. Just wow. Just wow. So many things that are wow about that. So uh, first of all, just let me mention Floor's outfit. Floor always wears the most incredible outfits. But that one... Oh, how amazing does she look in that outfit? It's just, oh, goddess, isn't it? Power goddess energy. I love the sparkles. I love the, the everything about it. I think it looks awesome. Anyway, I have to, had to mention that. Um, so right from the beginning, I'm glad we had that little footage of the crowd there before that track because... Oh, it's just incredible. I mean, I know now that Night Nightwish fans are just the most incredible fans. Thank you to everybody who's like welcomed me to the world of uh, Nightwish because you're all incredible. And and that just shows, doesn't it, how integrated the band are to their fans, uh, how excited the fans are, uh, how much they know the music to be able to do that that spontaneous uh <laughs> singing at the beginning which i think genuinely took the band by surprise by the way but also what i want to say about that is um it's all about giving and receiving energy now live performance only works when the audience is there the audience is responding and the audience is on the same kind of energetic wavelength and it's obvious from that performance all the way through that the reason that that performance is so uh, up here, I mean, every performance I've seen of Nightwish is incredible, but this one particularly has this extra energy. I mean, the way Floor is on fire during that, isn't it? The way she's talking to the crowd and then singing and just the energy and the dancing in the middle, that really comes from the audience reaction. Um, it's twofold. It's giving and receiving of energy. And and I tell you, even on my live streams, yes, I'm I'm essentially performing to a screen, but I know the the community that's there and and follows me in my live streams and responds brings me energy. I've I've kind of got. I've got used to how to 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 receive that now. At first, it was very strange performing to a screen. Um, but it makes a huge difference. It really, really does. And that's just on a live stream. But in, in a venue like this with that many people, wow, there's, it's just it's a human experience that can't really be replicated. So um, 
incredible and this performance is is made on that just i just really wanted to talk about that because i think it's really important um so the track itself is amazing troy is just a genius isn't he with those pipes he's nobody plays them better um i just love how tight it is i love the the sound he's in the middle there in the in the uh the instrumental section he's playing with the guitarist like totally in time totally playing the same thing as the guitarist which not easy to do not easy to do one because you have to play exactly the same notes and two you've got to play exactly the same time um and with something like this where it's incredibly intricate and incredibly fast that's really difficult there was also um a key shift halfway through that it shifts up a key and uh which works brilliantly by the way just the energy lift there incredible um but totally don't miss a beat like they're totally on it and yeah it, it just make it look so easy so yeah just a wonderful wonderful performance uh all round but uh I think what makes that performance extra special for me is the the interaction of the band with the crowd um pff, just amazing just 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 amazing so thank you very much uh to Hans uh who suggested that one uh for me to react to that one uh definitely a big flutiful thumbs up Troy doing the magic there and um yeah wonderful wonderful so um thank you again I I'm, I kind of don't know what to say now <laughs> I'm gonna go and whew, gotta go and relax after that one but um yeah incredible and I hope you enjoyed it too do leave me your comments down below and uh subscribe and hopefully I'll see you at a live stream uh very very soon all the details on my channel page so take care and uh I'll see you again bye